Good morning. Good morning. Welcome back to another vlog. Today is a really, really special day. Ollie is still in his cast. I know you can't tell because he's just sitting here. He's doing really, really well though. We have a doctor's appointment today and we are we have been looking forward to this appointment for like ever, right? So he is officially six weeks out from his break. Where are you going? He's gonna show you his skills. <laughs> so today, don't hop around on it. Sit your bottom down. I'm not hopping. Okay, <laughs> I have to like control this kid, otherwise he just does whatever he wants on this thing. But yeah, so it's been six weeks, so we go today to the doctors, he's gonna get an x-ray. I'm praying that we can get this off any day. We're really, really hoping. It might be another two weeks, but it really hasn't been the worst two weeks ever, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so Finn is actually at school and I actually just came back because Brian and I are doing a Calico winter retreat right now. We're staying at a little house um, just like not too far away and we've got a lot of our Calico crew up there and we're riding and hanging out, making music, making like TikToks and stuff. Um, and so we're just been having a ton of fun with them really just like kind of like bonding, I guess you could say. But Ollie has a dark appointment so I ran home we're hanging out. I'm actually gonna take him to the park to go play for a little bit before we head to his very exciting doctor's appointment. Okay, we're on our way to the doctor's appointment, <laughs> and I hope it look and I hope my leg looks good. I'm so excited to see the picture mm -hmm. of it because we've only seen it looking very broken. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm so curious. It's been like four weeks since your last X-ray. Mm-hmm. You think you're gonna get it off today? I don't think so. I don't think so either. But I'm hoping. Uh-huh. <laughs> Praying. If we can get it off today, that'd be cool. That'd be so cool. Mm-hmm. Cause if the doctors didn't switch it to eight weeks, um then um this day would be the day I have my cast off. Yep. So maybe I can't have my cast off. Yep. Hope your leg did a lot of healing over the Mm-hmm. Getting the hang of the crutches? Uh-huh. It has been so much nicer now that he's in crutches. I don't have to lug his wheelchair everywhere. His shirt, his shirt gets all caught up. I think your doctor's gonna be impressed with you on crutches, huh? Mm -hmm. You guys, we accidentally put him in these shorts with metal zipper. So we had to take him off and now he's wearing these like, these silly little shorts. Okay, we just talked to the doctor before we went in and he was like, well, if he's walking on it, he might be ready to get it off. And then I peeked at the screen. I swear to you, it looked perfect. Mm. Like not even a crack. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm <laughs> you can't get too excited. We don't know. We don't know what's gonna happen. They made me just keep it on. Don't be bummed. Remember the plan was, we don't know, okay? Okay, that was a whirlwind. <laughs> the doctor walked in at first and was like, I think we can get this thing off. And I'm like, what? And then um, we did x-rays and he was like, eh, I probably should leave it on a few more weeks. So um, it looks so good though, you guys. Um, I don't know if you can compare with the last one, but her eye hole, I guess. It was like literally cracked right here and that's all healed. It just has a little bit more healing, maybe like right there. But overall, it looks amazing. A lot of healing has taken place. He's doing a great job. I'm so proud of him. So we're getting it off in two weeks, but then it's officially coming off. So we are excited. It'll be interesting to see. Yeah, I want it off too. It'll be interesting to see um, how much he, how good he is at walking right away. Cause it might take some time before he can like walk. He'll have to like work up that like uh, strength and stuff and that muscle. He might even need a little bit of physical therapy to kind of do some exercises to get that leg back up to where it was. But exciting! It's looking good. Love you. Oh my gosh, I just took Ollie to the park and all the ducks are like surrounding him. What do you have? Oh, Tic Tacs. I don't think you guys are gonna like some Tic Tacs. I'm not feeding them. Okay. I just had to go uh, show you what Ollie's up to. <laughs> just got bit by a dog. He's over here. Scary, look at my <laughs> He's being crowded by ducks. They're so cute. How can they hurt you? Let me no, try. No, it, it bit me. It 
They got my they got my Oh Pink up. Yeah they're fighting. <gasps> Go baby! Sorry, sorry, I'll do it, I'll do it, I'll do it. Ah! It touched right here. It's not going to hold me to it. There you go. <laughs> They're so cute. Here, crunch it up to the knee. Oh, yeah. There you go. Is that good? Oh, pretty. Is that good? Look how Look pretty it. they that, are. Those two ducks have been chasing each other for one minute. Oh, week. they have been chasing. <laughs> You're so sweet to feed the duckies. I'm going to address this because I feel like no matter what, people always say something like, you're not supposed to feed the duck bread or crackers. They need like duck food. You've given them duck food. They don't like it. They don't want it. I think they just are raised on bread because they live in a community where people just give them bread. And so they don't even know what good food is. We've tried giving them like veg like fruit, like strawberries and watermelon and they don't want it. They don't want duck food. Ow! That one got him. They just want crackers doesn't make it right but this is the only thing that we can give them that they actually eat mama they're like piranhas watch this if i drop this on the ground they're all gonna come and just eat it like piranhas yep. Ready? gone it's all gone. Not even a oh my okay, you guys, change of plans. I just pulled Mr. Finley out of school, and guess what we're doing? What are we doing, Finn? Getting a haircut. We're getting a haircut, and we're not just getting a regular haircut. We're cutting this mop up. He's not sure if he's excited about it or not. I think me and uh, Brian are kind of like ready. Oh, I'm not ready. <laughs> he's not ready. We've had. It is his hair. He's had a mullet now for, I think, over a year. Long time. I don't want them to take my hair and put it in the trash can. <laughs> It will take a while, but you can grow it back if you want. <laughs> I think you look quite handsome, like my little boy again. <laughs> okay, Finley just asked me how old I am, and I said, how old do you think I am? Yeah. What do you think? If you had to make it... 59? That is a really good guess, actually. I'm not 59, though. Hmm. If you had to guess another, what would you guess? I'm 32. 32? Is that young? Yeah. Do I look young? Mm -hmm, yeah. Oh, thank you. <laughs> no, really young. I, I look really young? Thanks. But I want to say that we're together when we're 63 years old. Run out of room to hang up all our pictures on the walls And I give up when it feels like we're both falling out of love I wanna say that we are one of the lucky ones